Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Neelam Ahuja. You can also find me on Instagram at neelam.ahuja. Today I want to review the Row Robin boots. They are um, a familiar silhouette. They reminded me immediately of the zipped boot and in trying them on and styling them, I'm finding that they're very similar. So we'll go through some of the basic styling, pricing, sizing, um, and comfort. The style, as I mentioned, very similar to the row zipped boots. They are uh, an ankle Chelsea boot on a platform rubber sole. Uh, these ones, the difference, I guess, between the two would be the, they're both round toed, but that center seam, if you replace it with a zipper and then bring the leather a little bit further up, you have your, your zipped boot. This Robin boot is same in terms of weight and comfort. It has that heavy sole at the bottom, a rather unforgiving, inflexible sole, and it uh, the leather on it is not too soft, but not too hard. Uh, the sole will get scratched up, also very similar to the zipped boot. If that's something that puts you off, it's not going to be the boot for you because even out of the box without having worn them, there was a, a mark or two. It might have just been post-production getting them into the box for the resale uh, to wholesalers and retailers. The getting in and out of this boot is a little tricky if you have a high instep. They have elasticated sides here and a pull tab. You're going to employ all these tools to get your foot in and out. I have a very narrow foot, relatively flat, and I, I still, you know, had to use a little effort to get my foot in. It's meant to be that way because it's meant to be a sleek fitting ankle boot. The sizing is much like the zipped boot. So if you had seen my review on the zip boot, you'll know that I went down a half size. I'm normally a 36 and a half and I went to a 36. The reason being is I don't tend to wear socks with my boots and if I do, it's a very thin sock. So if you're like me and you have a somewhat narrow foot and you don't tend to wear socks, you can easily go down a half size in the zipped boot. When I ordered the Robin boots though, I took my true size. I just find that now, so going forward, I'm trying my size first and then seeing if I need to go down or up. So I ordered the six and a half. They're okay. What makes this a little tricky and why, if you're like me, you might consider going down a half size is because it doesn't come up all the way and because you don't have that zipper to secure your foot in the shoe and because of the inflexible sole, as you're walking, your heel slips up. It, it pops out of the, the boot. And I did contemplate going down to a 36. I have the 36 and a half, I was walking, I was slipping, and there is a bit of room. My foot does move a little bit, but not so much that it would make me think in any other boot that I have to size down. But because of the nature of this and the fact that my heel is popping up, I thought, well, maybe I should go down a half size. The problem I see there is that I think it's still going to do the same thing. I think that my foot will be nice and snug. It'll be very snug, like a tight fit in the six. Uh, and I'm still going to be coming out of the back. So I don't think this is a boot that I would size up. It is one of those boots that you have to get used to. You have to get used to the weight of it and you have to get used to the fact that because of the style you're going to be uh, coming out the back and if you are prone to blisters you might need to put a couple bandages there wear a very thin ankle sock and pricing 12.90 us i think uh they're new and they're not on sale most retailers are, are carrying them in terms of styling them they're so easy to style i actually tried it out where i i put a robin boot on one foot and the zip boot on the other and wore a pair of trousers to see if I could see the difference between the two and I couldn't. So styling is easy. At, at any way you're going to style the zip boot, you'd style this boot so with denim, with trousers, with skirts. If you didn't hop on the zipped boot bandwagon and you're, you've been waiting and think that that's um, a dated look, I don't think it is. It's part of the Rose Classic core collection and it's been around a while and it's sticking around. But if it bothers you that everyone is wearing them, then this is an excellent option for you. The other thing that this boot has going for it that I really like, and I don't know why I like it so much, but I do like it, is the fact that the ankle peeks out. So you're wearing a skirt or a pair of slacks and 
you cross your legs and you can see that little bit of skin and it's unexpected because with a chunky boot like this, you just assume that it probably goes up above the ankle. And I think that's really cool. I think for me, because I have the zip boot and styling is so similar, I really need to contemplate whether I need to add this to my collection because there's so many other things that I want. So I'll be thinking about it. But if you don't have the zip boot and you're contemplating and you're looking for some advice, I highly recommend these. I think they're amazing. I think they're a durable stomping boot and they are comfortable. They're actually comfortable aside from that little slippage at the back. A really good, uh, a really good boot. And that is your Robin boot review.